Every Thank time you. I see you, your style is so on point. Thank I you love so it. Much. Are you involved in the process? Because I know a lot of people yes. are. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely involved. Um, I'm still figuring out how to translate my personal style, I think, like onto the red carpet, but like finding my wings with it a little bit. Uh, it's so much fun. It's like getting in drag. It's like dress up. You totally. Know? Yeah. Well, you're crushing it. Um, I was thinking about the, the movies that you've done and the list, like thinking about Hunger Games and then Darkest Minds and The Hate You Give, and they're not like the cuddliest of movies when you think about the topics. Why is that really important? lightweight, you know, like romantic comedies. <laughs> You're doing stuff that is important, and I, I love that about you, but why is it important for you to choose this subject matter that you have been? Um, it's really the only way that I think I, I could do it. If I, I'm only interested in being a part of work that I think can in some way make some sort of impact, whether it's instilling empathy in a group of people who aren't exposed to a, an experience or don't understand it, mm -hmm. um, or just through the power of representation, being able to see yourself on screen and feel represented and empowered by it. Mm -hmm. um, those are the most important things to me. And it, if I didn't do that, I don't think it would be fulfilling for me. Totally. I know that in the, in the issue you spoke about the presidential election and how it left you feeling. Do you think that that impacted how you speak out and how vocal you are? Maybe in some ways. Um, I think we're living in really chaotic times and I don't necessarily feel like it's most effective for me to utilize my voice in the way that I used to, which is just by speaking more directly through social media and everything. I would rather uh, take concrete steps and actions in order to help the causes that I believe in or express whatever it is I want to through that instead. And that probably has something to do with our current administration. Yeah, kind of hard to stay quiet in yeah. some way, right? Yeah. Um, and who did you bring tonight? Um, I brought a bunch of friends. You, did. you <laughs> yeah. roll deep, huh? Yeah, I'm rolling <laughs> deep. Posse. Yeah, me and the girls are going to have fun tonight. Love it. Um, yeah. Anyone you're excited to see or hang out with? I mean, you go um, to all these every, things all the time. Everyone. My sister is coming. Aww. And my sister doesn't usually come to these types of things. So <laughs> I think you get to see awesome. your sister all the time, don't you? I get to see her, but we don't really do this together okay. that often, so this will be like really fun. That's yeah. cool. Well, congrats on everything, Thank darling. You. The Hate You Give is getting so much buzz. Like, it's got to feel so good. Thank you. I'm really excited to share with everyone. Yeah. I know you were really hands-on with that project, too. Why was yeah. that so important to you? Um, it was important to me because I love the book. I got a, an early manuscript of the book, and I immediately fell in love with it and was like, this is such an incredible piece of material. This has to be done right. And so I was able to really advocate, I think, for Star, the character, and Angie, the, the author of the book, and just mm -hmm ensure that we gave everything the authenticity that it deserved. Yep. Um, yeah, that's so. amazing to bring yeah. it that far. One more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell. Never miss a video.